took a shower and since I have my hair dump, I'm gonna apply today all of clicks. This is the number three and this is this is supposed to repair and strengthen your hair. This is pretty good. I have been taking care of my hair. As you know, I didn't do anything since January third. <laughs> with the only exception, I color my hair. I dye my hair with a box dye like four days ago. Yeah, because my hair was pretty grassy. So if you want to watch that video, it's gonna be here. I'm doing deep conditioning and I'm doing Olaplex. So for the Olaplex, I just need to apply it on damp hair. Oops. And I just apply it like this. And then I apply it all over my hair. And you're supposed to leave it for at least 10 minutes. I'm just gonna leave it overnight. All right, that's it. I'm just going to put my hair in a bun. And I'm just gonna leave that the Olaplex. Works, something like that. I ended up with a really sophisticated bun. In the meantime, I'm just gonna proceed with my makeup. I know it's late, but you know what? Who cares, right? If I want to apply some makeup on my head, I'm just gonna go and just do it because that's what makes me happy. All right. So I already applied my moisturizer and as always, I'm using the Lancome, the Visionary. And this one has SPF 20. I already applied my sunblock as well, Neutrogena. This is a new discovery. This is the Glamoufage by Hard Candy. This thing is amazing. It's full coverage and I just found out at Walmart and it's less than $6. It's like six or seven bucks. It's amazing, but this is not my color. It's a little bit light. Look at that. It comes with like a, this applicator. What I'm doing is that I mix it with my 24 hour by Revlon. So this is Hard Candy Glamoufage. What I'm doing is I'm mixing it with my Revlon Color Stay 24, 24 hours. And I know somebody is gonna be like, oh, what are you doing? But you know what? That's what I do. So I mix the two foundations and then with my beauty blender that requires a tip to get in. I just dab it all around my face. I still have some bruising around my eyes. Remember, my eyelid surgery, blah, blah, blah. I talk to, about that all the time. Should I move? Look, there, that's way better. I move. I think that we have better light here. So this is gonna be my new makeup station. So this is my office slash makeup station. I feel that I need to use this Dior. This is the Dior Nude Air Luminizer and I am loving it, really. This is the color. This is the 004. <clears throat> mm -hmm. A little bit like this. I'm just gonna be removing my makeup like in three hours, three or four hours. Okay. But we're gonna have quite a transformation. Blum, blum, blum. I can hear the door. I close the door. But it's the wind. The 
if you hear like a noise, blow, blow. That's the door. Or maybe it's my cat that wants to get inside. Wants to get in. That's all for control. I'm forgetting my nose. I have to control my nose because it's needed. <laughs> what? I find makeup to be like really relaxing. I'm just gonna contour my, uh, no, I already did it. Oh, no, I'm gonna contour here. There you go, a little bit. I saw Kim Kardashian doing this. And I think that is genius. Okay. Done. Now I'm going to proceed with blush and I'm using the Lancome. This is the Cedar Rose. I'm just going to apply a bunch of it on my face. Look at that. And I just apply it, you know, above the contour. Right here. A little bit here so it looks that I was sunbathing nope it's just blush and with highlighted okay we have 001 by Dior or we have Iconic London or we have hard candy which is a little bit beat however I buy this one because I love this color so much let's let's use this one let's say this cost like six seven bucks and I love this color I only buy this because I like this color hard candy you should make like one package just for that color You see that? This thing is amazing. So I apply here and here and then here. And then I'm just gonna apply a little bit here. So I look more alive. I'm just gonna go and do this. Oh, I forgot to apply concealer. I apply contour. Hopefully I say contour instead of concealer. Well, this is contour. And I forgot to apply concealer. You know what? That's it. I'm not wearing any concealer. No. Too late. I probably need to use a different brush. I'm going to refill my eyebrows. I'm just going to use eyeshadow and my eyeshadow is not here, so I'm just gonna go and grab it. <laughs> I'm back. All right, for eyeshadow, I use the Nudes by Maybelline and I use this one, the darkest color. And I just go I need a mirror. I'm using my cell phone. So I just go and just fill the gaps. Something like this. You see the difference? Okay. A little bit more for the other eyebrow. All right, 
right. Eyebrows done. So now lips. Okay, where's my MAC lip liner? Here it is. Of course, is well. Here there. I don't want to cook today, so I asked my husband, hey, we're ordering pizza. He's like, deal. So we're eating pizza for dinner. I'm pretty sure the kids are going to be so disappointed. <laughs> they love pizza. Yeah. Okay, right? Huh. That's okay. Now, I'm going to use Color Pop. But I'm kind of sad because look at this it's almost gone this is the shade of cookie and that's my husband moving the trash cans <laughs> he takes the trash cans out of you know on the curb and then he brings them back all right so what are we doing with ice I don't know what are we doing with that ice Sometimes I'm like, I regret to put something on my eyes because they're still like so sensitive. Yeah, so that's my husband. Um, we're gonna keep it simple. We're gonna be, I'm just gonna go full no. I'm gonna buy some eyelashes. And I'm just gonna do a simple, instead of eyeliner, I'm just gonna go ahead with eyeshadow and just apply it as a eyeliner and to be honest with you since i had i had hooded eyes all my life until you know the surgery i'm just recovering from the surgery i don't know how to do my makeup i don't know how to do my makeup on my eyes because since I had hooded eyes. I was doing some, you know, techniques for hooded eyes to simulate, you know, bigger eyes with hooded eyes. And I watch a lot of YouTube videos about, you know, hooded eyes, makeup for uh, hooded eyes. But now, I think that I need to watch more videos because I don't know how to do my makeup right now. Now that I don't have hooded eyes, yeah. So I pretty much don't know what I'm doing. Big difference, right? It just looks, we look more awake with the eyeliner. Well, in this case, it's not eyeliner, it's eyeshadow, but it's still, it's kind of the same. And that's it. All right, so now I'm gonna dress and probably I'm gonna wear a bodysuit and sweatpants or a bodysuit and high-waisted jeans or a bodysuit and jeans. I don't know. It's going to be involved some kind of bodysuit. All right. All right, so this is my afternoon's outfit. Did my makeup because I just feel like it. Uh, my hair is covered with Olaplex number three. <laughs> I'm just going to leave it and sleep with it uh, overnight. And tomorrow I'm just going to wash it off and continue the treatments. Okay. okay. And then, of course, bodysuit from H&M that I just love it so much. These are peach high-waisted jeans that I love them so much. They're super comfortable. And I'm wearing my NMD Adidas that are so comfortable guys you have no idea and i just paired it with this sweater okay so i decided to show you the dresses that i bought from asos um so okay i only received two dresses because i placed a two orders so this is one of the two orders so i'm expecting the other package soon i guess because i placed the order the same day 
okay but this is good at least i can show you these two dresses so i have this black one that looks pretty cute i love the ruffles here at the you know here are the shoulders and as you can tell i'm into you know ruffles and then i'm looking for the perfect shirt dress and i bought this from asos i'm just and it's a good steam here yeah okay so i'm gonna show you this these are from asos hopefully they fit because they're so cute i'm gonna show you this later i'm gonna try them on and then i have this art package I already took a peek but let's pretend that we're gonna do an unboxing <laughs> so i only received two items so it's a partial order but ah, let's do the unboxing so i bought a shoes i'm gonna show you later and i bought this like cardigan it's like a wrap sweater that is so cute this was on sale so original price was a 39.90 and it's so cute i bought size small i couldn't find you know medium or large because i was shooting to buy like the you know the large size well they only have large but yeah i bought a small because that was the only available i know for a fact that this is uh, sold out so cute so let's try it on and let's do a little bit of unboxing look at this this is so cute <laughs> all right so let's do an unboxing here let me just move this really careful okay so let's open this one These are dupes of the Bottega Veneta. They are square heels. And they're so, so, so cute. Love the color. It's like a bone color. Oh, what am I doing? It's kind of difficult <laughs> to film with just one hand and just trying to take these babies out. Anyway, okay, let's do it like this way. I love these ones because, let me just pull this out, look at this, so a square toe and then they have this, it's kind of like a flip flop so the shoe is secure and look at the heel, square heel, so cute, okay, so these were 69.90 and these are size 39. 39? Why did I do that? Okay, I'm size 38. Okay, 39 USA size 8. Seriously? Yeah, these are 39. Why did I do that? Oh man. Okay, well, hopefully they fit. Yeah, because I love these shoes so much, but I don't want that they fit like really loose, right? Yeah. Okay, so let's try them on because more than ever, I'm just really curious to see if these babies are going to fit. They're so cute. In fact, I'm gonna take an Instagram picture. Yeah, they're so cute. All right, I'm just going to go ahead and try them on. And I'm just going to do a try on haul for you with these four pieces. Hooray. Okay, guys, so this is the sweater on. And I love it. Yeah, I was so lucky to find at least I small. <laughs> it's so cute. And this is exactly how I, you know, I'm just going to wear it with my vegan leather leggings and my sneakers. And if I want to, you know, elevate the outfit, I will just change it to boots, maybe like pointy uh, toe uh, boots. So yeah, 
really pleased with this one. I can pair this cardigan with dresses or denim shorts for summer. Yeah, this is definitely a keeper. And I love the color. Love the oatmeal color. Okay guys, so these are the heels on. I love them. Okay, I need a tan really bad on my feet. <laughs> but they're really cute. These are size 39, I am size 38. I really want to try the size 38 and compare, you know, the fit. Yeah, these are pretty cute. A good dupe of the Bottega Veneta. And they're super comfortable. Yeah, they're super comfortable. Yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Should I keep them? I mean, they don't look too big, right? All right, guys, so this is the dress on. I love it. Love the ruffles here. And the length is perfect. My only concern is that it is a little bit loose here. So you can see my bra here. And the bag is open, so you can see my bra right now, but I think with a bralette will look really cool. I don't like pads, just to wear pads, I don't like that. I find, you know, really uncomfortable. But with a bralette, yeah, that would do it. Um, but I still think that it's a little bit big. This is size six, maybe a size four will look better. Oh, look at that. Yes, yeah, way too big. So maybe a size four or maybe a size two. Yeah. This is a little bit loose, so probably you need to size down. It's cute. The fabric, it looks like a little bit, you know, like Chinese or it looks like satin, but it's not satin. I think it definitely it's polyester. But yeah, it looks it looks a little bit shiny. So I'm pairing it with this bag from last year. And I think that I bought this bag at ASOS. And my saludos that I highly recommended. They're so comfortable and they're so cute and they have different colors. And super comfortable too. It's so cute and so pretty. Okay, let's try the next dress. Okay, so this is the shirt dress. Obviously, it needs to be ironed because <laughs> you can see wrinkles everywhere. But did I just find my dreamy shirt dress? I think so. <laughs> you can see my biker shirt. It is a little bit see through. You can, you can see where my biker shorts are. So I need to wear something underneath, definitely. But the lens is right. And it's true to size. This is pretty cute. I'm pairing it with the same espadrilles from Soludos and my raffia bag from Asus from last year. And yeah, I like it guys. I really like it. And I can just pair it obviously with a slit underneath, but I can just wear it with a belt. Let me try it with a belt and see how it looks. All right, so this is a dress. Yes, this is another kind of outfit, but since it's like a neutral color, you can do whatever you want, right? So I am showing you the dress with a belt just like that and I'm just pairing it with my combat boots and my vegan leather jacket and here you go you have another outfit here so it's pretty versatile to have a you know like a button-down dress it's kind of like a you know the white plain blouse but instead of the blouse it's a dress right so here you go and even showing you know my biker shorts looks it looks kind of cute. Yeah, super versatile. And 
that. I think this is a keeper, definitely. Because I can wear it in a different ways. All right, guys, so I'm just gonna let you go because I need to iron this shirt. <laughs> Look at the all effects. It's right enough. But yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna, just gonna wash it off. Anyway, my husband just declared couch time. What that means is that he already ordered the pizza. <clears throat> and we're gonna be watching Netflix the rest of the afternoon. And we're gonna be watching Netflix. We're watching the Ozark, by the way. It's so good. Highly recommended Ozark, guys. So good. Highly addictive. And okay, we're gonna be watching Netflix and we're gonna be eating pizza. Sounds like the perfect plan. The perfect plan. What is that? For Oh my gosh, this is not one. Kyle, take a piece. Mm -hmm. Pepperoni.